Hey guys, good morning. It is 7.20. We've been on the road um, for about an hour and a half. We are on our way to Michigan to get new Idaho pasture pig lines. Super exciting. Got one kid sleeping. The other one just woke up. Bye Stevie Wren. <laughs> uh, we're still in Maine. But we're going to take the long way down so that we can enjoy Vermont and New York and stuff like that and make it kind of like a family vacation and then we're going to come straight back quickly with the piglets so they're not in the trailer for forever. in Vermont. Very excited babies. It's so wonderful in here, isn't it? Oh, you like those small ones? You don't want a bigger one? You don't want a bigger one, honey? You want a small one? Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> Kingston is working on spreading dandelion seeds. Yep. Can you do it? Good job, guys. Yeah. So, ending the day in New York, I have two very very high recommendations for you guys um first i believe it's called sticks and stones um it's a um fire okay so you can come inside with us for a second so sissy can go pee okay so we had to move inside because the kids were cold and uh are finally running out of energy after being in the car all day anyways um Two recommendations for New York so far. Highly recommend Sticks and Stones uh, restaurant and um, like everything that they gave us was absolutely delicious. The mozzarella moons we had, their Hawaiian pizza has prosciutto on it. Oh my gosh, so much flavor in their crust, everything. Um, the sweet potato fries were phenomenal as well. Super, super awesome place. And I don't say that often about restaurants because I cook everything from scratch. So, um, <laughs> the second place that we recommend is the place we're staying at right now. Um, the Alpine Lodge. Super cute. Super cozy. There's a huge outdoor area. That's where the kids were just running around to run off their energy. There's a fireplace in this room and a jacuzzi tub. This is room four. Um, so highly recommend both of those places if you're in the upstate New York area at all ever.
headed to Massachusetts today. It's going to be the longest drive so far. Um, we, it's probably going to be, it's 10 hours without stopping for like lunch and whatnot. So it's probably going to be a good 12 hours. Um, so we'll get there a little later, probably 7.30, 8 o'clock at night. But um, the next day, Massachusetts is obviously very close to Maine. So um, the next day is just like four hours, five hours-ish. Um, so that's going to be super quick. We'll be home before like 1 p.m. So, um, yeah, we are on our way home. The pigs are doing really good. This is a really long drive today for them. So we'll be giving them electrolytes when we stop, um, in Massachusetts for the night. But other than that, the trip has gone extremely well. Uh, right now, Paul is changing the alternator in the car because it was losing power. It was not happy with us.